Maria. So welcome back to my YouTube. I hope you are all well and enjoying the weekend. Um, in today's video I thought we would do a what's in my wardrobe and like how I style my own wardrobe. Um, because it actually has been requested quite a lot, quite a while ago now, and I'm actually only now getting around to doing it, so I apologise for that. But it's here, that's all I've got to say really, here it is. It's, you know, not that glamorous, it's not that walk-in wardrobe vibe. Um, but yeah, this is my wardrobe, and you wanted to see it, so... I'll show you around. So pretty much let's get into the video. Okay, I'm gonna try not to move too much because my floorboards are super squeaky, but we are gonna start on this side, which is my jeans. Um, just so you know how I order it, it goes jeans, shorts, skirts, like little crop tops, love when it's on the hanger properly. Um, T-shirts, long sleeve tops, knit jumpers, shirts, a couple of hoodies, um, dresses, and then my blazer, and then there's just like a, um, what's it called? Uh, oh my god, what's it called? Dressing gap, and then here, oh for um, so, first of all is two pairs that I do not hardly wear, I'm not obviously going to get everything up because that will take forever, but I'm going to just get out a few of my like favourite pieces that I love. So we have some leather trousers. These are just the Zara ones. I really like them. I got them last year. I didn't manage to wear them that much. Um, but I'm going to definitely take them to uni with me and get some more wear. They're really soft on the inside as well. It's, it, they are they're a nice vibe there. These are Topshop actually. I think I got these like a couple years ago. Um, just like a suede. Not suede. See, this is why I just don't film videos like this because I do not know how to describe things at all. These are a checked trouser, um, which I really like. They're really nice and high-waisted and come up really high, so I love those a lot. We have these trousers, which I love. These are from Uniglo. They are like flared, um, like linen material. These were actually on sale for like nine pounds in Uniqlo so that was a pretty good steal although they're a medium they are a little bit big um but they come with, they come with a tie so you can have them as cinched in as you want and I like to cinch it in quite a bit so then it kind of looks like a paper bag style trouser here we have even bigger flares these are huge these look like you're wearing a maxi Skirt, which I don't like because then you trick people and you're like no they are trousers these again are like a really soft almost like linen-y material they're really really soft um I wore these actually quite a lot for work because they are really comfy and nice and airy um these are just some like beach trousers I own these were from Italy I think in like some random sh um, little like boutique shop and I think these again were on sale for something like 11 euros. So I picked those up and I wear these all the time in the summer when I'm chilling, when I'm on holiday. Um, like just a really good throw on thing. And then here we have the classic. Is this really weird just showing you one trouser leg? You can't really get the full vibe, can you? These are the typical Topshop ribbed um, trousers which are like flared. Everyone has them. Every girl has these. Um, and then these. I will actually sh right. I'm gonna get stuff out now because this is really probably boring for you guys. These are some um, checked lilac, pink, green trousers. They look like I'm going to play golf, but I kind of love that style. My sister actually got me these from Australia, from the brand Glassons. Uh, in the size 10 and I really really like them they look so cute on um, they are like full length as well they look really nice with just some air force that kind of thing and like a little crop like this or just like a little white crop top I would really like that outfit I haven't actually worn that so I will wear that so this is probably a good thing me going through my wardrobe because then I'm like I really need to start wearing more clothes I just stick to my my usual basics um, and then here we have some plain jean beige jean trousers a nice sandy color love these these go with anything 
I'm just gonna say now all my trousers are high-waisted. I don't own any low-waisted. I think that would just not look good on me, you know, that just wouldn't, wouldn't fit the vibe. So yeah, love these. And then we go into some jeans. These are actually just like pretty little thing ones I got last year. Um, I had some Zara ones and then I was about to leave the house in a major rush, bend down to go do my shoelaces and they split out the arse. So I'm very glad that did not happen when I was outside the house. So luckily I had time to change. Um, but they were like my only pair of jeans. So I was like, oh my God, I need to order some. So I think you just ordered some pretty little thing ones. I actually really like these. These are kind of like straight leg mum jeans. Um, we really like them, just plain. Although they've got a bit of like a weird color at the moment. So I don't wear them as much, but you know, they'll do. This pair is actually one of my favorite pairs. As you can tell, I like clip three, two or three items on each hanger because it works. Like, I don't need all these hangers in my drawers. Not in my drawers, in my wardrobe. Um, these are these ones. I absolutely love these pieces. They are getting, okay, they're really tight at this point, but I love them. These are like a piece I do not want to chuck away or not chuck away, but like sell or give away. Um, because I love them, they're just so cool, and I feel like they're not everyone's style at all, but I just love them. They're just like a straight leg um, at the bottom as well. These are Brand Melville, actually, so no wonder they're um, really tight, because they're one size, and little me three years ago squeezed into them perfectly, but now it's like... It's not a fun time, you know. Moving on, again, I have some more beige trousers, which I got from my sister. These are cords, which I really like. They are Urban Outfitters. I'm actually really impressed that I know all of where my pieces are from, you know. Oh, and these are Obey trousers. I really like these. I got these two years ago. Um, but I'm going to keep them for uni. And if I wear them throughout uni, obviously I'll carry on keeping them. But if not, I'm probably going to sell them on my Depop. Because at the minute I'm just not wearing them. But we'll wait and see until uni because I need clothes. And then again, I just have some more plain white, like, what are these? Almost like chino material, you know, that 2011 chino vibe. Um, these are those. But they're cute white. These are from Zara. Um, love these. Really cute in the summer. Although, like, the button's a bit odd. Like, it's kind of a bit wonky. I don't know. That might have been why it was in the sale. So, I don't know. Um, and then these, I love, you've all seen these when I bought them, I think they're in a haul at some point, my lilac denim mum jeans, they're like a flared bottom, got some nice makeup on the bottom there, um, love these, Topshop if I didn't already say, so absolutely love those, and then, I think you've seen these before, these were in my last video, whoa, the hanger, these were in my last video, nice and creased. Um, as I said, they fit perfectly. They're a little bit tight. Have I literally put on weight in like the past week or two? I don't know. So we'll, we're gonna squeeze ourselves back into those. And then these are just my vintage mum jeans that I wear every single day of my life. <sighs> I feel like these were all in the hauls. I have not worn this. I should sell it, but I'm like attached to it. Again, this is a nasty girl piece. It's like a midi skirt also a wrap skirt that I wore last year in the summer um it's really cute but I haven't worn it this year like I've had nowhere to wear it to so I am going to keep it I'll take it to uni maybe that with a nice black cropped will be cute so I could wear that um at uni we shall see and then on this one these are like oh wait no these are like a couple of my favorites so this is a Zara um like a denim Zebra print, as you can see, pretty cool. Wore this to festival last year. And it's quite good to keep for just like clubbing and stuff. And then I have my cute little tennis skirt. Again, it's very tight from last summer. <sighs> I don't know what happened. Okay, quarantine happened and I got a ton. And then on here, again, a couple of my favorites that I just don't wear. So this is Zara, wow, I didn't realise how much Zara stuff I had until this um, this video, but this is a pink faux leather mini skirt, love this. These are some shorts, they were actually off Depop from Sophia Tuxford, so Sophia and Chintzia, I thought these were really cute, I got these last summer now, and I wore them a lot last summer, but they are a bit tight now, so I might have to part with them. Um, and then this is just like my top, top favourite skirt, this is Princess Polly, 
I love it so much. It's like a dainty um, sage green with little white floral bits on. Absolutely love that skirt. I will never get rid of that. So my hair is so gross. This little crusty bit here can piss off. Oh my god, this is going to be the world's longest video. I am so sorry. Again, this um, skirt you've seen, H&M Love Plain Denim Skirt. Okay, so now we're on to tops. And I'm going to just pick a few because I've got so many. Um, so can you see? You can kind of see there, can't you? Okay, so this one from Pull and Bear. Haven't worn it that much, but I want to wear it. I'm going to try and show you pieces that you haven't seen in hauls. So this is actually one of my favorite um tops this is <laughs> Sarah and this is like a ruched um like lots of fabric on it can you see it's like crinkly um love this plain white crop that just looks cute with everything um and I just love I love all like the ruching vibe this is nasty gal last year I really like it it's cute little pink pink polka dots um ruched at the back and has cute little ties. I wore this at a festival last year. This again is another one of my faves. I These are all like ones that I just don't get to wear that often. But I love them. So I keep them for when I do have something to wear them to. Um, but I love this because this just ties at the back really nicely. Hangs beautifully. And that is a Zara number of course. Here I just have literally just some basic crop tops. Zara, Zara. And this one here is an outfit. It's great to have a load of basic vests. They just go with everything. This one, really cute. A little Brandy Melville one done there. Cute. Love. Um, these are both from Opoly. So this one is like a... I don't know what kind of material this is. But it's basically a tie top with some like frilly... Um, sleeves really like that and this is the kind of the same vibe so it's like a linen material ties again and has like a really ditzy white floral print on there really like this top can't wait to wear this at uni for like just in the day or clubbing will look really cute um urban outfitters and then here i have like my favorite tops which i've just got over time that i wear like every now and then just a plain urban outfitters um t-shirt with like a cute little embroidered bit here um and then as you've seen these before they are just some plain brandy melville tops that you know i love this is a cute one sorry about the makeup stains on there but this is from brighton it's just from a little like corner shop that i really loved ollie actually got it and then i stole it off him so love that for me this one's really cute i feel like you guys will like this this is a nasty gal last year um this is like a satin material really cute like bell sleeves with a lace i think this is from the emily ratajowski i think that's how you say it that's from her um collab which i love and um, again i don't get to wear that often and then here we have um just like a plain navy and white t-shirt that will just you know go with anything i love that um this is the brandy melville it's like a um what's it called a cardigan cropped cardigan um which i love and then here we just have some again some plain tops which i think you've literally seen all of these before so just a couple of different like colors um some gray ones this is really cute this is from top shop in the sale i got it like quite a while ago now um, again, thought that'd be quite good for clubbing and things. I'm someone that doesn't really dress up that much for clubbing. I just want to look like casual, but like nice makeup. That's just how I like to look. And then this, I don't know if you remember this from Christmas, actually. Um, but this is my little Christmas top. And I just want to part with it. It's really cute. I feel like there will be some time where I can wear this. So I'm going to keep this. And then that's all that's Zara and then this is also Zara which I again I've had for years I love how like floral and cute it is nice embroidery on it nice and you know cute I feel like I could frolic in the field in that um and then here just like a plain um nude jumper a plain black knit jumper this is again one of my fave ones this is just a brandy melville um knit jumper which i just like to throw on whenever um this one i got for christmas this is a motel rocks i love this green i love all kinds of green honestly i think this is really cute really big and oversized 
so I cannot wait for winter when I can start wearing it again and then I have this knit um cardigan Zara um and literally like my fave one I had this in a haul um this is just a pull and bear really oversized um v-neck jumper I literally throw this on all the time with whatever I'm wearing um just a little kind of like gray white um cardigan i'm literally forgetting all the words I'm just, the words are gold here we have my god my legs are really hurting from standing up this long and then we have this really cute um piece again from zara love it so much it's like a pajama style so that is very cute and then this again this zara like what's this called almost suede like i don't really know corduroy um which i feel like every girl has so if you don't have one of those that just goes with everything um this is like my one of my favorite pieces again this is like super old really big um and this is from like we are cow which is a like a second hand shop which sells like really cute stuff so i've had that for years and then this one is pull and bear i had this two years ago wore this on holiday quite a lot and haven't really worn it since but i thought for uni like dressing up nights that might be quite cool and then i have just a couple my two favorite hoodies which one is my white uniglo hoodie i wear it all the time um i feel like you've seen it 101 times and then this one which technically is ollie's but you know basically mine <laughs> um is the kanye um hoodie love it literally it's the softest hoodie ever i just love this gray color and i just love like the writing on the back i think that looks super cool and i feel like this was in one of my videos this is like my charity shop find which is like a musto um zip up neck which is really cute cute for going to the beach with some shorts finally we're on to dresses so here i have just this plain black dotty one the detailing kind of looks like that um goes all the way down super cute well it's actually like a mini dress kind of comes like just past my bum so it's quite cute um it's like a doll style dress so it's like quite froofy as you've seen in my last video and my london vlogs i wore this dress in the evening in london and i can't wait to wear it again honestly i love it so much this was in my recent video as well it's the ruched um just mini dress love that from urban outfitters again this is urban outfitters in from depop in size medium i was super super happy about that and then this one we have it's kind of like weirdly put on the hanger um but it's like a wrap dress from brandy melville i love this one I, fun fact i actually had this a few years ago like four years ago and then my dog chewed it and then my mum bought me a new one so that was nice huh? this one again which is the one i wore in london um this is i think i wore it in like a beach vlog this is again one of my favorite pieces it's just nasty gal um super cute and like sure it's just like a throw on over your bikini so i really really like that this i don't know if you remember this this is what i wore on new year's eve it is just a midi um with a slit down there from h&m so then this piece is from top shop this again was last year i wore this in ibiza when i went to see david getter that was really fun i love that and again perfect for clubbing this one you can tell i have not worn it in a while again i think this is zara and i got it for ibiza when i went or croatia last year again it's just a like dark emerald green midi with again slits on the bottom so i love that and this is actually probably one of my favorite dresses i actually wore this for a wedding and this is <laughs> zara and i love it so much it's like really nice material has buttons down going all the way down and then oh i don't know if you can see but it has like a let me hold it up really high has like a slit at the bottom in the middle and then it's a midi dress so i absolutely love that and then as you have seen before this is my blazer which is from a charity shop i got last winter 
so that is now everything hung up in my wardrobe so i'm gonna quickly do my jumper and um john bottom collection okay so you have seen this hoodie before i got it in london and it's been one of my favorites so i love that that is a zip up hoodie this one is from new york from a charity shop this was literally or a thrift shop this was literally like three dollars i absolutely love this perfect and oversized i got this in 2015 and i still love it and i still wear it every week um this is a, another new york find from the same time i went this was again in a thrift shop but this was a bit more expensive um i think this was like 60 dollars um but i love it it's really really cool it's the yankees so again i literally wear this every week too and then i have this adidas vintage jumper it is literally huge like it's so big but i love it it's really really comfy ollie likes to wear this one as well well to be fair he wears all of these um but this is like an xxl i think but i think i got this on north workshop which i found on instagram and they have a website with all like cool vintage hoodies and jackets and stuff and then up here my hoodies are kept up here and down below where my shoes are also there and then this champion hoodie i got two years ago i love it just a plain like sky blue color again i wear this all of the time so yeah i want to say that is it for my hoodies there's a couple more but they're just a bit like random and i don't really wear them that often um and for my jog moms i literally have two pairs one pair is this urban outfitters pair um which i love it's that it's that is friend um french brand i think on there probably saying that totally wrong but i love these again literally wear these every single day love those for the evening and then just this pair which i showed you in my last video which is my carhartt pair so i think that is literally everything if you want to see accessories and shoes then i will do that as a separate video because i feel like this video is going to be super long already um so i will certainly do that for you another time so that is the end of my what's inside my wardrobe video i really hope you enjoyed i kind of actually love filming this so i will film my accessories and shoe collection at some point it's not that big you know don't get too excited because i'm not really an accessories gal and i've only got a few trainers so it's nothing exciting but if you do want to see that i will of course film that for you um, so yeah, I really, really hope you enjoyed. Make sure to leave me a comment. I'd love to chat to you guys. And leave me also suggestion, suggestion videos down below. Um, I'm leaving for uni in less than two weeks now. So if there's anything you want to like see around the house, them kind of videos that I can do whilst I'm home, let me know now. And then if you do want to see like me preparing for uni, um, I've bought everything but if you want to see a haul of everything I've got I would love to do that so let me know and I will be filming um, going up there so uh, I'm super excited for these vlogs because our studio is really cool it's like a studio apartment for me and Ollie so um, I'm so excited and I've been buying loads of like nice interior pieces so I really want to show you and I'm sure you will enjoy those videos because they are like my favourite videos to watch. So anyway, I will see you very, very soon with a brand new video. Bye! Mwah.